outside smokes as well to make things a little bit more obscure. But big have a two man setup in ladder room, which is quite interesting. Let's see if that works out. Tizzy with the first edge or one v one. Beautiful, yeah. He saw the barrel of the gun poking out. He knew, uh, and there's a third one for Tizzy, a nice tight angle, and no one can really deal with it, it seems. The bomb is still in the hands of Fnatic, but the round doesn't seem to be. DW takes out Smuya by going for a containment. They do have an incendiarius and a smoke, so there is the, some. I mean, that's that's really useful for the retake. Smoke off banana, perhaps. Uh, I think a situation like this, well, the four versus four, while they were all on A, would be a great, like if you showed the run up to this, if you ask loads of players, would you go for retake here? Would you say, I think it'd be interesting to uh, discuss because you can see this is going to be a really difficult one. I mean, Smear is just having some fun on the B bomb site with all the channels open. But um, it'll be until they get closer. So he's going to take up that porch angle, that lane angle, and it's an easy kill. Tizian's looking into the bomb site. Now they know where he is. JW for the ace, for the pistol. Can he make it work? Here comes a challenge, switches to the burst, but Xantaris shuts it down. And he goes with the full defuse here. So it's a tight one as well without a kit, but I think he's got it. It's, a kin. it's really tight. Oh my god, what? he just doesn't have it. I thought that he had that one. That was very too. close. Well played to JW. And that's a round that Jake probably shouldn't have lost. Now Tapson getting that kill. The lead is reduced to four for Fnatic. Has to feel confident going into that one. Smuya is ready for fast make top mid. In the meantime, Zantares will be lost. Tapson looking to do what he can. The transfer is disgusting. The pre-fire behind the half wall as well. Talk about a shutdown. Oh my god. What the hell was that? That's unreal from Tapson. How fast that transfer was. It is hard to believe. But he's pulled it off somehow. Kerem's in a 1v3. We have two smokes each. Or, well, one smoke each. Fnatic. R.I.P. Rodan in the back of the site. New box. Smoke is up. That actually gives him a place to fight. He can't see if you want him now. He's being patient. The bomb is being defused though. Perfect timing. Just in the last second. Does the knife come out? It's got to. And there we go. 16 to 11. Fnatic will take it first. No one can really deal with it, it seems. The bomb is still in the hands of Fnatic, but the round doesn't seem to be. GW takes out Smuya by Connector. Got three plays streaming out of Connector for Big. They are committed to this B bomb site, although Connector starting to wonder. GW looking for a 3k as well. Showing the bomb on the ramp. This is crazy. Golden has made his way in. Surely this has been heard. Oh, that's Ooh. a great burst onto Next from a 2 versus 5 to a 2 versus 2 to a 2 versus 1. This has been turned around absolutely ridiculous. The Fnatic factor at play. 45 seconds, they're looking for Tabson. He's got to be here somewhere. There he is, three for Golden, two for JW. Oh God. And Tizian surely has his head in his hands. Those are some There we go. For that 10th round, finish things off nicely. Rapper though on it, but Tabson has something to say about that. Tabson, ever the pair of steady, reliable hands, but he'll get incinerated. Now Zantaris has to do it. Oh, they'll walk into the spray, but the trade is there. Bro, and he's going to nail it, and that's going to be a wrap. 10 to 5.